Today we're going to learn how to do animated sprays in basically any Steam game that you can use sprays in. Okay, the programs we need is Adobe Image Ready and Photoshop. Um, Image Ready will come with Photoshop and VTF Edit, so you can just download that from Google. But for now we'll go into Adobe Photoshop. Um, once you're in Photoshop, just go to File, New, go to make the width and height 158 by 158. It has to be that size or it won't show up in game. Click OK, you'll notice it looks really small, but it doesn't really matter. Now you can do your own images or draw it or whatever, but I just got some frames from a movie so I'm just gonna open them up one two and three so I've got two three frames doesn't really matter what format they are in to start off with let's go have a look at them I've already done it so they're already 158 size so it'll make it quicker for the video now all you have to do is drag it into your your new 158 and try to put it in order it's better if you put it in order so you don't get confused and then close the windows that you don't need and now your main one that you just created you'll notice that it made frame 2, 3 and 4, these are important that each picture is on a different frame because if it isn't you're going to be all confused. Okay, just fix up the ones that didn't go on properly. Okay, once you've done that, um, you've made your frames perfect and stuff like that. Um, one, two, yeah, I got f three main frames. I uh, once you done that, just quickly go up to file, save as. Um, make, save it as a Photoshop PSD or PDD. Um, just call it some um, whatever you freaking want. Gibberish doesn't really matter. Save, click here, okay. And now go into image. Um, close this down first. You don't need to in um, Adobe Image Ready. Just go up to File, Open, and that gibberish file, the PSD that I created. Open it. You'll notice it came up with uh, the picture up here. Drag it down here, and you'll see the animation screen. If you don't see the animation screen or your layer screen, just go up to Windows, Tick Animation or Layers. Now, you come down here so you can see both. Um, I'm going to click this three times. I'm um, create new layer. No, duplicate current frames actually. Click it three times. So they're all going to be the same now. But we get to change this. So select the second frame. And we don't want to see frame three and four. So we click this and drag it down to zero. Click this one, drag it down to zero. And now on the th we click the third one. We don't want to see four, so we so we select that and drag it down to zero. And the last one can stay like that. And now we click um the play button. And the animation will look like this. See, it looks pretty realistic, but obviously fake sort of way. Now, it may look really, really fast now, but it will slow down in-game. Okay, now go up to File, Save. Oh, no, this is the tricky part. You don't go to Save As. You go to Export Animation Frames as File. And it'll come up with this. You can name it whatever. I'm going to name this Spray. And um, the format has to be P 
PNG24. Um, and leave everything else. Click OK. Now close this. After you saved it P as a PNG24 thing. Um, open up VTF Edit. Go to File. Import. And then locate where those pictures are. I called it spray, so it so sprays one, two, three to four. Just select them all, click open, click OK, and you'll notice it will come up here. You can pl press the play button, and I'll show you the animation. Now this is the really important thing. Click click info. Yeah, see here where it says size if. My size is 42 kilobytes. If it's over 120 kilobytes, your animation spray will be invisible. So try to keep it under the 120 mark. Now, go to File, Save As. 